Hello again everybody, Boyd here with you. Well today I'm introducing another board in our line of the Trekwork Signature Series Sound and Light Boards. This particular board is designed to be used with the AMT Enterprise Bridge model kit that's available out there. Uh, this one simulates the uh, sounds inside the bridge and we've added some uh, special lighting effects on this one as well. Uh, we're going to be able to light up the uh, red alert, uh, flashing red alert indicators that were on the walls located next to the uh, view screen and the one back by the turbo lift doors. Uh, and they'll sound and flash at the same time as when the red alert klaxon is going off. We have the original sounds installed on this from the classic uh, television series. We have five uh, sounds in total here. We have uh, the opening monologue of Captain Kirk uh, doing the uh, Star Trek monologue with the uh, opening theme music. And then number two, we have the ambient sounds of the bridge, which I've extended uh, quite a bit longer than they are on the uh, first board that we put out, which is for the classic Enterprise. Uh, it runs about a minute and 30 or a minute and 40 seconds long, so you get a nice long looping uh, sound of the bridge, and you'll hear the uh, turbo lift doors opening and closing and all the instrumentation and the uh, view screen scanner. Uh, so that's pretty cool. And then we have the red alert klaxon, and then we have uh, the classic phaser firing effects and the photon torpedo firing effects. So this will be a really cool addition to your bridge build. Uh, I'm going to demonstrate the uh, lighting effect of the uh, red alert, but keep in mind I don't have a switch hooked up to this right now. When, when, you, when you actually buy this kit, you'll get a uh, push button switch that will be included with it that will allow you to uh, turn the lights off and on so that these lights won't go off all the time when you're hearing the rest of the sounds. You just simply push the push button when you want to activate the red alert and uh, those will flash and then when you don't want them to flash anymore you just push the button again and you can listen to the rest of the sounds without the lights going off. Um, so I'm going to demonstrate the uh, red alert first so you can see the uh, lighting effect and the sound of the klaxon. So here we go with that first. And so you can see there that we have uh, a nice little lighting effect that goes exactly matches with the sounds. You'll get with the kit two of these uh, three millimeter red LEDs, which you can mount uh, up in the wall behind your uh, red alert indicators. Like I said, there's one located near the uh, uh, view screen on the original Enterprise, and another one next to the turbo lift doors, so you can light that up. And uh, but let's go and play the rest of these sounds here. Pay no attention. I'll just kind of move these out of the way. Uh, like I said, you'll use the push button to uh, shut those off, but let's play the, these other sounds we have here for you first. Here is the opening monologue again. Okay, so we have that one. And again, keep in mind, everybody, that the uh, sound will be much clearer and a little bit louder once you mount this inside of an enclosure. This speaker is facing right down into the ground or onto the top of my towel here on the uh, bench, and it's muffling the sound quite a bit. It uh, sounds much better when you mount it inside of an enclosure. But let's go ahead and play the bridge ambient sounds next.
Okay, as you can see, we've got quite a long uh, loop there. It runs about a minute and 30 or a minute and 40 seconds, so uh, that's plenty long. And uh, if you wanted to hear it longer, you just push the button again. So we'll skip the number three here, one which you already heard, which was the red alert, and we'll go to the uh, photon, uh, actually the phaser firing effect here. And then finally the photon torpedo firing effect. And so there you have it guys, and totally have five sounds on this board. It's a really great little setup, and uh, just like uh, the rest of these, you'll get a uh, the board just as you see it here. You can replace these momentary switches if you want. Um, there are some aftermarket switches of all different types available for that. And uh, we'll also include the uh, push button switch so you can turn off the lights when you don't want to see the, uh, the flashing from the uh, red alerts going off and you only want to have it come on when you're playing the red alert sounds. Um, this comes, like I said, ready to run on 9 to 12 volts DC. It's very easy to hook up. When you buy one of these, you'll get a uh, confirmation email with a link uh, to a video that will show the instructions on how to wire this and set this all up. Um, and so uh, we hope you guys like this one. I'm working on uh, the refit will come out next, the board that we're working on for the Enterprise refit. And then I'm working on the Klingon Bird of Prey and uh, the Klingon Katinga Cruiser next. So... Uh, and then we're going to move on to some Star Wars stuff and some maybe Lost in Space and some others. So uh, got a lot of neat stuff coming out on these guys. I really appreciate the support uh, you guys have shown for these so far. And for this price, they're uh, really a, a nice bargain. And we're trying to keep these, like I said, low price for the uh, hobbyists out there and make these affordable. So uh, thanks for checking it out, guys. We'll talk to you later, and happy modeling.